Hello, in this video we will talk about how AI can be beneficial for programming and for the programmers. AI can be significantly beneficial in the field of programming, offering various tools and capabilities to assist developers in enhancing their productivity, improving code quality, and even automating some aspects of the coding process. Here are some ways AI is being used in programming. Number one, code completion and autocorrection. AI powered code editors in integrated development environments, IDEs, provide intelligent code completion, autocorrection, and suggestions that help programmers and software engineers write code faster and with fewer errors. These tools learn from vast amount of vast amounts of code to suggest contextually relevant completions. Number two, bug detection and code reviews. AI can analyze code to detect bugs, vulnerabilities, and performance issues early in the development cycle. It can also assist in code reviews by identifying potential issues that human reviews, human reviewers might overlook, thereby enhancing code quality and security. Number three, automated code generation. AI models, particularly those based on large language models like GPT, generative pre-trained transformers, can generate code snippets, functions, or even entire programs based on high-level descriptions or prompts provided by the user. These can accelerate the development process, especially for boilerplate code or common programming patterns. Number four, refactoring and maintenance. AI can suggest or even automate the refactoring process to improve code readability and maintainability without altering its functionality. It can also help identify and update deprecated or vulnerable dependencies. Number five, language translation. AI powered tools can translate code between different programming languages, which is especially useful in migrating projects to a new technology stack or making code accessible to developers with expertise in different programming languages. Number six, learning and documentation. AI can assist in onboarding new developers or learning new learning a new programming language by providing personalized learning resources, answering programming related questions, or offering interactive coding exercises. Number seven, predictive analytics and project management. In project management, AI can analyze historical project data to predict timelines, identify potential bottlenecks, and suggest resource allocations. This helps in making informed decisions and improving project outcomes. Number eight, optimization and performance tuning. AI can suggest optimization or perform automatic tuning to enhance the performance of applications. This includes optimizing algorithm, database queries, and system configurations. Natural, number nine, natural language processing in development. Developers can use AI to convert natural language commands or descriptions into code, making programming more accessible to non-experts -expert, non and facilitating rapid prototyping. Number 10. Security and Compliance. AI tools can proactively scan code bases for security, vulnerabilities and ensure, and ensure compliance and industry standards ensure compliance with industry standards and best practices, thereby enhancing the security posture of applications. As you can see, we have discussed quite a few number of points where AI can aid in programming, helping the developers, programmers to speed up their development. And definitely I can go into details of each of those aspects, but I just wanted to share maybe one or two examples so for example, more than a decade ago, when uh, I was leading a team to optimize a major code base, 
it took us quite a bit of time to understand the code because we first generated the abstract uh, syntax trees of the code base then we kind of reverse engineer uh, the whole code to understand where are the issues to, to identify the optimization opportunities and things like that. So I'm not going into details of each of those steps, but what I wanted to say that it took us quite a bit of time uh, to understand the code, to figure out the optimization opportunities and then actually implement them. But what you can see now with the power of AI that AI can suggest optimization or perform automatic tuning to enhance the performance of the applications. It can also suggest like optimization algorithm, database queries, system configurations. So you would, you and your team would be spending less time on finding those um, opportunities for optimization. Similarly, uh, for compliance related aspects, you can do it much rapidly and much accurately with the help of AI. Same goes for the project management, predictive analytics. So you can, um, with each new project, you can improve based on the learnings from the previous projects, right? Um, same goes for the documentation, language translation, refactoring of your code base. So if you want to refactor the code base, you have to you know, manually look back um, at okay, what are the optimization, uh, what are the refactoring opportunities? But now you can ask the AI companion, uh, and it can help you to identify okay, these are the chunks of the code which need optimization or refactoring. Uh, these are the chunks of the code which need to be split into further uh, smaller modules, smaller functions, smaller uh, code uh, blocks. This way, it would not only increase the readability of the code, but also understandability and reusability of the code. Uh, and of course, um, you can automatically generate the code, which was, um, when we started learning programming, it was difficult because you had to, you know, kind of come up with the code yourself. But now you can also ask your AI companion and to get to augmentation. Even in the first place, asking just directly AI to write the code and then adjust it to your need. Or you can write it yourself and then check your AI companion that uh, how much correctly you have written or which are the areas that you need to improve or change a little bit, adjust a little bit so that you are writing it in a way which is more readable, reusable, right, more legible and things like that. Um, code completion and auto correction so you could leverage that functionality um, this will help to reduce the errors and um, you will be able to write the code much faster uh, have the auto corrections and things like that also for bug detection and code reviews you can rely on AI companion uh, as it can help you in the in reviewing your code by identifying potential issues, issues that human reviewers might overlook and thereby, thereby it enhances your code quality but also the security of your code, security of your application because as it will leave less potential loopholes or vulnerable places in the code which can be attacked by the hackers, right? Um, so these are, are all very important aspects that you can look at um, how AI can augment or help you in the programming. Another thing uh, that I wanted to um, say before concluding this video is that just imagine how peer, peer programming used to be difficult because first you need to have those people uh, or enough people in the team and then you have people with the patience to sit with another developer and you know kind of review or observe the code and uh, it has been difficult I'm not saying it has been impossible it has been implemented in many companies many places but not everywhere but now if you uh, bring AI companion to your help you could take that as a pair programming experience and exercise I think that would be wonderful so to sum this up, incorporating AI into your programming workflow can significantly reduce 
manual effort, speed up your development cycles, enhance your code quality, and even democratize programming by making it more accessible to people with varying level of expertise. So now everyone and anyone can you know, work on coding or programming exercises. I think that's really cool. That's really great um, strength, which comes to everybody's access. Uh, so try to use AI Companion to your help to augment your programming exercise. And let me know in the comments, in the feedback, or if you want to know anything else. Have fun and enjoy this video. Bye for now.